Hello Gemini, Sun, Moon and Rising and welcome to this week's reading with me. If you are new to my channel, please do subscribe. Let's get started for the general readings for Sun, Moon and Rising Geminis. Well, 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 how does it start? It starts with a wonderful creative energy. So Geminis are being very creative at work, in their sentimental life, in life in general. They are being very, very creative. You are called upon to be creative. You are called upon to be spontaneous in whatever you are doing, my dear Geminis. I am also seeing that um, some of you might start a creative project. Some of you might start a channel, start learning music, start learning painting or whatever. And if you're already in a creative field, then this is a wonderful time at the beginning of the week, my dear Geminis. And I also see whatever you're going to do spontaneously is going to pay off very well. So whatever comes to your mind, like the, you know, the genius idea that comes into your mind, just write it down and just progress upon it, my dear Gemini. And this is a wonderful, wonderful energy for all your work pursuits, uh, for whatever you want to do whatever you want to achieve even for Gemini students is very very wonderful period because they can be very creative regarding the way they are expressing themselves uh, this is what is seen my dear Gemini's and then we go to the midweek the midweek is putting you in contact with a feminine energy this person can be uh, your beloved it can be uh, a mother figure it can be a good friend it can be, um, yeah, uh, a very, very loving person. It can also be your grandmother, I would like to tell you, is that who is very loving, who is very giving, okay? So the midweek, you are dealing with a feminine energy at this point of time, uh, younger or older, and you are, uh, you know, taking care of them. For some of you, it's like you're taking care of this feminine energy, or maybe you are called upon to take care of them or spend time with them or you're meeting them after very long or you are on the phone with them and spending a lot of time discussing with them is also seen. While for some of you, you are spending more quality time with your beloved at this point of time. Uh, for some of you, it can be also a new person who is coming into your life. Uh, my dear Gemini, this is a new person who can make your heart beat uh, uh, faster and you know you feel there is a potential over here you you look at them like a potential partner those of the Geminis who are single this will apply to you all right and uh, the other Gemini shouldn't start getting very happy that oh I'm going to find something new no you better stick to who you are with if you're happy of course <laughs> and uh, yeah otherwise yeah oh wow <laughs> Yes, so uh, yes, in the midweek, this is a loving energy who doesn't expect much in return, who's the one who likes to give to everyone, this kind of an energy you're dealing with, my dear Geminis. And for some of you, you are finding that partner, that marriage partner, uh, this is what is seen also. And then we go to the end of the week. And the end of the week, you're extremely dynamic. This is what is seen. You are extremely dynamic. You are Your heart is on fire. And uh, you are like that achiever's energy is seen. Real passion is seen in your, um, your closest relationship with your beloved. There is a lot of passion energy here. There's a lot of intensity that I see at the end of the week. I also see that at work also, you're going to be very, very punchy. At um, and regarding your sentiments also, uh, you can be a bit aggressive. So you need to take care of that, my dear Gemini. Otherwise, you know, wow, <laughs> it can create problems because it's if you see the claws of the the lion, no, sorry, of the tiger, the claws of the tiger can hurt, right? Until you're caressing the tiger the good way, it's fine. It's just like the kitten. And the moment uh, you know <laughs> you are not right, then they will just kind of put their claws on you and make some autographs, give you some marks. So this kind of energy is seen inside of you also. So you can be aggressive towards your loved ones. So just be careful about that, my dear Gemini, not to be aggressive towards your loved one so that, uh, uh, you know, that intensity of love is shared in a harmonious way, uh, not in the kind of a fire, fire, ash, ash, okay? No, not that way, but in a kind of a steady flame. Uh, try to burn that 
flame of love like a steady flame that stays longer and is more durable and remember this even for your professional uh, in your professional field also that uh, if you have a lot of energy use it wisely if you give it all at once you're tired at the end of the day so instead of that just be more uh, how can i say mm, yeah more reasonable when you're spending your energies because gemini's can have a lot of energy and um, you know they can spend a lot of energy so they need to be careful about that but all in all the end of the week uh, you are ruling you are full of energy and uh, you are basically attracting lots of attention also this is what is seen however one small thing i would like to tell you is that uh, refrain put breaks on any kind of arguments that can arise by the end of the week because that can lead to some kind of uh, heated debates with close people all right or with colleagues so be careful about that my dear gemini and when i'm looking at this energy i would like to tell you the word that comes to my mind is be artistic be artistic you are already an artist my dear gemini but i would like to tell you is that you need to be artistically expressing yourself this week express yourself express yourself uh, through dance through music uh, through your cooking through your painting through uh, the way you you know do things whatever you are doing just express yourself let that expression uh, that art that is inside of you uh, get expressed Uh, to everyone my dear gemini's and uh, why am i saying that because i'm seeing there's a lot of energy inside of you and uh, this energy needs to be channelized in a positive way otherwise it can leave you very nervous very scattered a bit confused right so you need to be careful about that my dear gemini's so whatever comes this week be artistically expressive do everything mm, as if it was an art whatever you are doing if you're speaking if you're walking whatever it is and basically if you see uh, everything is an art isn't it everything is an art even the way we eat is it's so artistic if you see i mean in india when we eat with our hands you know uh, it's really so artistic i mean i i find it really beautiful because you know like when we eat with the chapati uh, my indian friends and uh, the my friends so all over the world who eat uh, chapatis uh, uh, will know how it is like you know how we you know take that piece of chapati how we dip it in the dal how we roll it in the dal how we make that small uh, you know we call it niwala in hindi yeah and then we we put it in our mouth right and the same with the sabji also like you know the way we eat it's itself it's so artistic i mean i find it very uh, very artistic because we use all our senses actually when we eat we all even if we are not eating with our hands i mean um, but in indian the way we eat uh, it's really when we eat with the hands we are using all the senses right the the eyes the touch uh, the odor the taste we use all our senses so it's such an artistic thing already have you tried that so when you eat uh, eat artistically also i would say and enjoy that because it's not supposed to be eaten fast because gemini's can have the tendency to eat really fast so when you eat it you know just be mindful of the way you are mixing the food see the texture of every food uh, that there is a lot of sensuality i feel also because every food everything that you touch has also that you know that sensual thing is that the sense you sense you feel that thing yeah so when you are eating you just feel how is the texture of the food how is the taste of the food and instead of thinking about all those things that are you know going on in the world you just be inside of you so it becomes a meditation so this little art <laughs> of eating also whatever you are doing not just eating but the way when you are sitting you are going around you are walking everything becomes an art the way you are expressing because you are expressing yourself here 
all right so make sure you express this art beautifully and become meditative in this art because everything can be done in a meditative way in a mindful way my dear gemini so just express your artistic qualities express yourself artistically and through that you reach the depth of yours um, inner being of whatever needs clearing gets expressed in an artistic way so it gets cleared also my dear gemini so thank you very much for listening please do like share and comment and i shall see you next week until then take good care of yourself bye bye god bless bye